Hey everyone, Shebim here and welcome back to episode 8 now of our Harrogate Town Youth Squad Legends. Right, I've changed formation as you can see. I basically brought the two wingers in um, to make them attack in midfielders. I'm going to play our two young Welsh lads that we know have good potential, Humphreys and Morgans. They're both 54 rated so it's a big risk to do this. But I feel like they're going to progress pretty quickly and it won't be too much of an issue. Um, also, we should get to our Youth Academy pretty quickly here because this is our last match of the month and then our next match is not till the 3rd of next month. So this should be a nice little run for us. So of course, ne uh, last time round we got a draw in our final match of the episode, um, which was pretty good uh, after losing to our rivals Bradford. We're still pretty close to the bottom of the table though. It'd be nice to pick up a few more wins. Uh, the board only expected 10 wins this season, though, and we've got most of them already, so it shouldn't be too much of an issue. So first starts, then what? Well, it's a full debut for Humphreys, but first starts for Humphreys and Morgan. Um, the two 16-year-old Welshmen. Say they've both got potentials at least in the 70s, could be up to the 90s for all we know at this point in time, though. And it's a pretty good starter so far. We've controlled the majority of the first few minutes. Of course, we're still playing with the five at the back. Um, but we're not playing with any whip up front now. But I have set for the two wing backs upon attack to um, to help out. So hopefully we'll see some attacking wing play with the wing backs and the 1-0 down. Da -da 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 -da. All that talk. Right. I can't believe we've had three players, or four players, if you include the goalkeeper. And three of them have all been in the same position, because central attack in midfield. Come on. Oh, I keep thinking the counter-attack's going to be on. Here we go. Nope. Again. So Morgan's losing the ball quite a bit in his own area, which is not ideal. There he's again, losing the ball again. Trial by five for him. Like I said, they're on the brink. Both of them are on the brink of hitting a 55. However, if I can get their match sharpness up and get their morale up, they should get, obviously with the um, the temporary upgrades, they should get up to 60 pretty soon. So at the end of this month, I'm hoping for stat upgrades for Ferrofino as well. He's played quite a few games this month, so hopefully he'll get a, a plus one again, which will take him up to a 54. 54 plus he has got the match fitness upgrade so he's up to about a 60 at the moment he's what's the level he's playing at still not fantastic for league two to be honest we should be playing at a higher rate but um it's the best we've got at the moment and it's keeping us off the bottom of the table at the moment which is the main thing if i can just get one or two oh it's two nil if i can just get one or two players in the academy this month that are 60 plus ratings we can greatly improve this first team greatly improve it I wouldn't say no to a strong centre-back as well. And a really good striker. And some midfielders. So, yeah, every position, essentially. But if I can find every position, I'm going to be very happy. <laughs> good right-back would be nice as well. I mean, even a left-back. Fer Ferrofino is not exactly a, a long-term option. He's just the best I've got at the moment. He's not the best I've got at the moment, to be honest. He's just a young player, so I like playing him. That's a penalty, isn't it? No, it's a free kick. That's a free kick inside the box. Okay. Don't know how that works somehow, but... They got a free kick inside the box somehow there, but we'll, 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 we'll ignore that. We'll pretend that never happened. So losing 2-0 here. Possession not in our favour, is it at all? Come on. Out wide, there's ball into the middle. Come on, do something with it. What's wrong, kitty? The kitty's acting up now. As soon as I hit record, she wants attention straight away. Uh, again... Uh, Morgan's losing the ball. He's not had the best of times, says he? Although he's having a better game than Humphreys, by all accounts. Well, 
Okay, off the inside of the post. I don't really need to make any substitutes in this game because they're... Oh, well, we haven't got a game now for about 10 days after this, which is good. We don't have to worry too much about the fitness, but... So Fallowfield's having a really bad game. Banks is playing well. Humphreys is a bit rough. Humphreys on his debut is not having a great time out there. It's trial by fire here, though. Trial by fire. There we go. Ferrofino. Oh, he's offside. I thought we were doing well there. We started this season quite strong, didn't we, that win against Barrow. Since then, it's been pretty downhill. Oh, 3-0. Okay. Oh, God, please let the academy be good this month. Please. We need strength. Especially since I've already sold a centre-back for the <laughs> January. I know it's all my fault. I know that I should not have sold as many players as I did, but we wanted the money in to get the better youth scouts. And in the end, that will make it in profit. So... It, it is worth it, but at the same time, it just means this beginning part is going to be a pain. Okay. Right, so yeah, we've got a rest day, we've got a training day. So we should get into the new month now as well, which hopefully means we should see some stat upgrades for a few players. Uh, I'm not holding out hopes for some of the older ones, but... There's the month, uh, the youth scout report for the month or the monthly reports. Youth squad reports. All right, so Pearson, 70 to an 88 is not looking ideal, is it really? Um, youth scout report though. Here we go. So this is from Wales again, 68 to 92. There's nobody there who's fantastic now, is there? 325, 80. 90 275 I feel like you can tell some stuff by their, their actual value the fact that he is 325,000 pounds interests me so we are going to sign him up and who was the other one was it you no you're 90 100,000 275,000 we'll take you as well um, and these three we can bin off I think is this the end of this? I think we've got one more month of Wales now, haven't we? I'm not 100% sure. Um, let's have a quick gander. Um, youth staff. Is that the end of Wales? We've got one more month. No, we've got that's the end of Wales. Okay. Um, so let's go to... Do we want to continue in England? Do we want to stay, try and stay realistic-ish? Or do we want to start travelling the world and... Just trying to find the best possible players. Let's go to Brazil. Let's try and find the best possible players. Okay. Okay, so let's see if we've got any good players now. We've got 253 rated players. Okay. No traits on either of them. They had really high abilities for now, though, which is what's confusing me here. And they're both centre attacking midfielders again. Oh, my God. Okay. Is it the game now, then? Okay, we've got another scout report back. Let's see if there's anyone we can bring in the team then. Where have you been? Please give me something good. Please give me something good. Okay, you're terrible. Okay, that's what we like to see. Walter Johnson, absolute hero. Um, that's good. Okay, Brett Kerr, no. Christopher Lee, 70 to 94, but your current ability is awful. And you're awful. Okay, we do have one. Um, hopefully, he's going to be good enough. If he's close to a 60 now, I'm going to be so happy. He's not. He's only a 52. He's a central midfielder again, of course. And he's only 15, so he can't even be brought up yet. Okay, so he's a central midfielder. Uh, let's do development plan on him. Let's have a look and see what he's like. He is much more of, say, a box-to-box -box midfielder than is he. Um, uh, box to box is this one, isn't it? So, not much defensive work involved in box to box, is there? He's not very good defensively. I mean, judging by how many midfielders we've picked up, I feel like it might be handy to have another defensive midfielder. Although his physical and defensive stats aren't great, we can build them though. 
How long would it take to teach and be a CDM? 69 weeks. Wow. I don't think that's worth it, you know. I don't think it's worth it. Okay. We'll just leave him as he is then. We'll make him into a playmaker or box to box. Ball winning midfielder. I think maybe uh, just central midfielder. What does central midfielder do then? So, vision, short pass, composure, dribbling, pace, stamina, strength. Okay, maybe just a standard central midfielder for now. Would be a good option. Or do we just stick with balance for now? Let's just stick with balance for now. Let's just let him uh, progress standardly and we'll see how it goes. But apart from that, I don't think we've really gained anybody. We've got a centre-back here in Christopher Lee. I mean, he's got a good potential, but his current ability is 34, um, which is going to be an issue. Although he could be a pretty damn good centre-back in the future. You never know. Um, so it's going to take him three weeks to get to the next level. Stopper, sweeper, ball-playing defender or defensive centre-back. We just want a solid stopper. Just a proper defender. Sweeper is... We want the strength built up, don't we, really? I think defensive centre-back is probably pretty good because you get pace with that as well as passing reactions. Okay, we'll go with that. We'll go with defensive centre-back. And hopefully, he's got a good potential ahead of him. Unfortunately, we sort of gain nobody we can bring into the first team now. Do we get any stat upgrades? Not that I can see. Banks is up to a 76, which is good. Apart from that, I've not really seen many other improvements here. Um, he's down, he's still 51. Wang's still a 49. I mean, Walker is up to a... Is that Liam Walker? Is that Liam Walker as in from Gibraltar, Liam Walker? Let me have a look. I'm interested now. Left midfield. No, it's Tom Walker. Okay. Um, that's not correct then. Yeah, he's up by two. See, Humphreys is up by one. Morgans is also up by one. Oh, yeah, no, they both got to 55. Yeah, sorry, yeah. They were both 54, weren't they? So they have progressed one. Okay, so it's not the best academy we've had so far. We have got a couple of good players, but um, unfortunately we can't bring any of them up yet. Yeah, we can bring these two up, but again, they're both central attacking midfielders. I'm not too... I mean... What was your value again? Can I see their value? Okay, so I can see the value when I sign them up, but I can't see the value now then, can I? It's not in here, is it? Okay. Because one of them had a very high value. Like 325, so... Okay. So, Walter Johnson, you have got a good future with us, but, um... Yeah, your age is holding you back. Because we can't... So oh, maybe I can. No. Got to be 16, okay. Well, let's continue pushing on. Hopefully those players will progress nicely. Um, we continue on with another difficult uh, month then. So we're down to one point away from the bottom now then. Yeah, we're one point away from the bottom. Only Scumthorpe and Grimsby are below us. The day we have Colchester, who are only slightly higher than us. You never know our luck. Maybe we could pull this out the bag. Let's see how it goes. Oh, I need to send the other scout back off, don't I? We've got another scout coming back, though, haven't we? Yeah, we've got one more scout coming back. Okay, so we might still have some good ones this month. I might spread the scouts around, so I might hold off this one that's only going to come back. I might hold him for a week or so and spread him around a little bit. Rather than them all coming back in one video. Spread them around and hope for the best. Yes, we should get one more scout report back after this game. Right, come on then. Morgans and Humphreys, you both had a plus one stat upgrade now. Let's see what you can do with that extra one. We're in yellow again. Let me finish this video and I give you some supper. And it is 1am. That's pr pretty much supper time, isn't it, I suppose? Come on. Okay. We're holding them off at the moment. 
It's a terrible pass. They do seem to be a very weak spot, don't they, Morgans and Humphreys? But I really want to play them as much as possible. I mean, if I can just get through playing them, I'm assuming they're going to go up plus one every month for the next few months um, because we're playing them so often. So if we keep playing them, they should progress pretty quickly because they do both have high potentials. But without the old training feature, you can't rush them now, can you? That's 1-0. Yeah, without the old training feature, you can't rush them to make them quicker. Because that used to be the trick, didn't it, really? Okay, so we're losing 1-0, but... We're doing okay. I mean, if we can get um, Morgans and Humphreys' sharpness and morale up, they should become much better players, of course, because you do get that temporary stat boost, which they haven't got as yet. Oh, was a terrible pass that was. Terrible. El Paso Terrible. And there we go. It is 1-0 down at half time. They are dominating everything, but um, you never know. Stranger things have happened, and they clear. She doesn't care. She does not care. Right, come on. I mean, I sort of just want this game to end so I can get back and see this last scout because... <laughs> Uh, the last scout is the Canadian one, isn't he? Is he the one we've got the goalkeeper from last month? I think it is, you know. Or is it? Have we just had Canada. We might have just had Canada. Where did we send the other one off to, then? Ah, oh, it's 2-0. Ah, oh, it's 2-0. That's not good. Okay, let's just make some substitutes. Now, we've lost the game. Let's just get some uh, some fitness and everyone happy, then. Um, let's bring you on. Let's bring the left back on for a run around. And let's bring Martin on. There we go. I mean, I would like to get to a point pretty soon where we can just get rid of all of our uh, Harrogate players and use our own Youth Academy players. That's the whole point of the playthrough, isn't it? To use our Academy players. Go on. Yes, get in. Morgan scores his first goal for the club. Nice one, Morgans. Nice one. I mean, I'm not expecting this to get back in this game still, but... It's nice to see one of the young lads get a goal. It's going to give him a good bit of form boost as well. And hopefully it's going to help him, you know, boost his old stats. Did we do like that? Come on. If we can get this, you never know. An equalizer will be massive here. An extra point... We don't get a lot of them. An extra one would be lovely. Terrible pass. We haven't seen Banks... I say we haven't seen Banks do much recently. He is still playing a 7.4 game. Uh, he is still one of our best players on the pitch. I think our last scout is the best one, isn't it? It's the one we spent the most money on. It's the one we spent like 700k on. So the last scout should be our best option at finding some crackers. Oh, okay, we're 3-1 down. Okay. It was a nice bit of fun while it lasted. We thought we could get back into the game, but it wasn't to be. Everyone can hear you meowing at me now. They know how much of a stressy pot you are. I'll give you supper in a minute. I want the scout to come back first. I want this game to be over. I'm done with this one now. We lost 3-1. Let's get it over and done with. There we go. Okay. Well, Morgans did get his first goal for the club, so that's the, uh, the the best thing that happened today. But the most important thing is going to be that the youth scout come back. So I'm going to save the other youth scout for now. I'm going to leave it for a couple of weeks and send them back out so we can sort of mix it up a little bit. Here we go. <sighs> come on, Sadler. Come on. Come on, Super Sadler. Oh, my God. There's two players. But one of them is Hoss. Oh, my God. 
Oh my god, you watch him be an attacking midfielder again, but that is insane. Both of those players are really good. Rory Hilton and William Walters. We could have just added two fantastic players to our starting lineup. If they're both attacking midfielders, though, I'm not going to be impressed. Everyone is an attacking midfielder. Oh my god, one of them is. He's a 67 rated attacking midfielder, of course. But 67 rated, you are in. Promoted. And a 56 rated, again, attacking midfielder. Why is everybody an attacking midfielder on this game? Everyone is. We'll take them both up. We'll put them both in the starting lineup. Um, well, definitely you can come in and you can come in. Walters will definitely play. And Hilton will play as well, actually, because he's actually better as well. Why are you not happy with that? What's your minus for? Because you're unha Why are you unhappy? Do you want to play central? I can't understand why you're unhappy, Walters. What is wrong with you? I've just brought you into the first team and you're unhappy already. Why are you such a stressor? Okay. Well, that worked out pretty well. Two, uh, two good players. We've got one more really cracking player as well with a great potential. Who is already unhappy. If we can try and find out why he's unhappy. Um, team performance is low. Okay. Okay, well, that's, that's fine. He has the potential to be something special. He has got a 90 plus potential then. We can have a look at this, can't we? So the goalkeeper's potential is not that great. Something special, something special. So we've got two players there with potentials over 90. Um, you're going... One of these on loan? I just saw here. Yeah, Dan Jones is on loan for uh, us. Okay. Um, any other potential? Oh, we can't see the clear players under uh, 60, can we? Okay. That's really good, though. I'm happy with that. I am happy with that. Uh, youth staff. So we've got one scout. Oh, no. I oh, know because he's on a nine month. He's on a nine month, isn't he? No, he's on a three month. He came back a month late. Okay. So we've not got to reset that one then. Okay, that's fine. Second, third, and fourth. Okay. So we're going to leave it there. We'll come back next time. We'll give these guys their debuts. And hopefully we can turn the luck of little Harrogate Town around and uh, hopefully bring them into the top end of the world. We'll basically just get off the bottom of the table, which is where we currently are now. We've got Bolton Wanderers up next. But uh, yeah, I've been Shabby Gamer. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you very, very soon for our next episode. Bye.